What's up all you beautiful people out there in YouTube land? I appreciate you for tuning in here with me today. Those of you that are returning, oh, I love you. You know I do. I appreciate you. If you're new here, my name is Dave. This is Callie's Groom Room. And right here, we talk about all things that relate to men's grooming, especially the key, the ultimate accessory to your wardrobe. And that is, of course, the wonderful world of fragrance. Guys, in today's episode, I'm talking to you about a brand called Dossier. They are an inspiration, dupe or clone house, whatever you want to call it. That's quite all right. But yes, they offer inspired by fragrances. We're going to talk about two of their offerings today right after that intro. Cue it. Come back. Stay tuned. I'll be right here with you again on the flip side. All right, here we are on the uh, flip side, I guess. Yeah. Uh, anyway, guys, if you don't know anything about this brand, I'd love to tell you. So, Dossier, their product here, their fragrances are vegan, cruelty-free. The box you receive in the mail, this cool little box, is... You know, let's just pretend that it's here in my hand, okay? Yes, thank you for just vibing with me and letting this roll, okay? Letting this flow. So, the box is made of 100% recycled material. Dossier, shout out to you. Let's throw the box. Shout out to you. Thank you for respecting our planet. Green is not the end all be all for me when it comes to my fragrance purchases, but it is a nice touch. Madison, who works for Dossier, I wanna give you a huge shout out. Thank you very much for reaching out to me, sending me these two fragrances. Without you, obviously this episode wouldn't have happened. So from the bottom of my heart, thank you. I appreciate it. All right, enough of the flab, blip, blab, and blah, 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 blah. Let's talk about the fragrances. I forgot a, a huge point. Holy crap, thank God. It's back in the old cranium. So when you receive your package, it's going to come with a 2 milliliter decan most of the time. Use that decan up. If you don't like the fragrance, send it back. Get yourself a full refund. If your fragrances come packed like mine, where you don't have that 2 milliliter decan, it's all right. You could use some of the bottle. You spray it on. You don't like it. Again, send it back. Get a full refund. Now, ambery saffron. So... Ambery Saffron, right here, this one is only going to run you 49 bucks, and it's concentrated at 18%. Concentration there, only 49 bucks because it's inspired by Mason Francis Kirkshawn's Baccarat Rouge 540. Guys, oh, I love BR 540, man. Absolutely one of my all-time favorite fragrances. Actually, both of these are two of my all-time favorite fragrances, but... Let's start things off here. We know what it's inspired by. We know the price, the concentration. So now we need to focus our attention on smell. Let me tell you, Dossier Great Sprayers, magnetic cap there that I showcased. I was playing with it, you know, like I normally do. Yeah, so here we have amber, we have saffron, we have orange blossom, cedar wood. You get that caramelized sugar, that, that sweet sugar kind of accord that's here. They really nailed this on the head. I would say it's anywhere between 85 to 90% true to Baccarat Rouge 540. Is it the same quality? Of course not, guys. It's an inspiration type of a fragrance. You are never going to get the same exact quality or 100% on par with the, uh, with the um, you know, fragrance that it's intending to be. In this case, Baccarat Rouge 540. But here, they do a great job capturing that DNA. The longevity, the performance on this is really good. You can get about an hour, hour and a half to projection, five to six hours on skin, seven-ish hours on clothing. This is a more intimate fragrance. Baccarat Rouge itself is a more intimate fragrance, meaning that people are going to have to get really close to you in order to really smell what's going on here in the, uh, in the DNA. But really, really nice. I absolutely love it. I find this fragrance to be very versatile. So you're not going to have to worry about seasons, occasions, all that stuff. At least for me personally, I wear Baccarat Rouge all year long. Any season, any occasion, doesn't really matter. I love the formulation that much that I wear it that often and in all those situations. So perfect one if you're looking for something versatile. Now, if you're looking for something just a little bit more potent with a little bit more versatility... I'm going to recommend Citrus Ginger. So let's talk about that now. All right, guys, Citrus Ginger, here it is. So this one concentrated at 15%. This is only $29. 
and it's inspired by Bleu de Chanel by Chanel. Now, the reason why I chose Citrus Ginger is because I know Chanel likes to keep things very close to the uh, house. They like to keep things very, you know, internal. They don't like their fragrances distributed everywhere because they want to keep them, I guess, away from discounters and such. Um, I, I don't work for them. I don't know. I'm just, you know, going based off of assumptions there. But same magnetic cap and everything like that. <sighs> so I'm going to be honest with you guys here. This is about 65, 70% close to uh, Blue de Chanel. That's the only drawback about this particular fragrance here. The upside is it still smells really, really good. This one performs better than Ambery Saffron, which I was expecting it to because Blue de Chanel, if you're not familiar with it, it is a very, you know, loud, could be somewhat, you know, polarizing type of a fragrance here. Projects well, first hour to two hours. Great longevity here. I mean, eight, nine hours plus on clothing if you do spray your clothes. So some of the main notes here, peppermint, lemon, ginger. We also have cedarwood, sandalwood here. Very versatile, very heavy on the uh, citrus. It is a citrus forward fragrance with that sort of woody dry down that is, you know, reminding me of Blue de Chanel. I wish it was a little bit closer to the Blue de Chanel formula. Like I said, still smells fantastic. In the air, it's great. This one is definitely compliment inducing. If you're one of those folks out there that's looking for compliments, you don't have to spray a ton of this on to garner yourself compliments. People are going to want to know what you're smelling because it is a familiar DNA. The difference here is you're not spending a hundred, uh, or I'm sorry, no, like 85 to 100, $125 for a bottle. You're only spending 29 bucks. It's definitely well worth the price given, like I said, the versatility. You can wear this again all year long, any season, any occasion, just like what I said about Ambery Saffron. Same rules apply, huh, rules, apply with uh, Citrus Ginger here. Fantastic stuff, you know, for what it is, for what they are, a brand that's not trying to hide behind what they do. They just tell you, like, we're, we're a freaking dupe house. That's just what we do. We're a little different. We offer a little bit more value than some of the others, but hey, this is what we do now. You're going to go on their website. It's very user-friendly. I'm going to link it down below. You're going to notice that they have loads of inspiration fragrances there. Tom Ford, <clears throat> excuse me, Tom Ford, Yves Saint Laurent, Hermes, just to name a few, but you guys go there for yourself. You're going to see tons of uh, fragrance there for you to choose. So go ahead, have at it. Who would I recommend Dossier to? I would recommend this for gift giving ideas. This would be great if you wanted to give a gift, very affordable there. Uh, if you're new to fragrance, you, you want to dip your toes into fragrance. However, you just don't have the uh, the money to shell out for you know $85 plus on a bottle of fragrance. This is definitely a great option there for you to, uh, to try fragrance. Also, if you're just on a budget and you're looking for something to get the job done, this is going to do just that for you. So yes, in those situations and circumstances, I do recommend checking out Dossier and uh, their offerings and seeing what you think about the brand. Guys, that wraps it up for me today. I do appreciate your time, your viewership here. It's much appreciated, like I always tell you guys. So on that, love each other, respect one another. Time is far too short. Make sure you call your family and your friends. I love you guys. I'll see you very soon. Until the next time, take care. Take care of each other. Peace.